hello riders uh, today I'm going to show you how to check the coolant the coolant quality uh, we have this uh, KTM Duke 200 in the workshop for some minor repairs including race dynamics piggyback installations now we'll be checking coolant quality this is a coolant cap the tool what we are going to use for coolant quality test remove the cap remember coolant is always dangerous for health due to antifreezes this is the tool what we are going to use this has got a lens inside a glass just specially manufactured for coolant testing only so be careful with it because it's a costly tool we'll pull out some little quantity of coolant we just need few basically you know drops coolant just drop it on the glass that's it the remaining coolant don't forget to wash it. The cap back on the glass. That's it. I'm not sure. Can you see? Let me just check out under the light. synchronizing the lens okay here you can see very clearly the propylene glycol percentage and ethylene glycol percentage it is about uh, it is near to minus 15 propylene glycol uh, level and ethylene glycol is minus 20 so that means the coolant can go up to that minus temperature so I guess our coolant level is perfect or the mixture is perfect in the bike right now we don't need to change the coolant this is the tool boiled from Wurth German tool this also tells you the water level or the charge level of the battery electrolyte you can see on the right it's extreme on the left hand side if it is bad then it goes down if it is good then it goes up see you can see on the left hand side that is a battery water so it's got three things to check out battery electrolyte propylene glycol which is for the coolant ethylene glycol which is also for the coolant this bike has got blue color coolant there are different types of coolants available in the market one is from uh, RPG or something that is for high performance racing this is a normal one one is from ice coolant this coolant also you can use engine ice is uh, ready to use oil pre-mixed with deionized water almost 1.89 liters this is a non-toxic biodegradable phosphate free and protects to 256 degrees Fahrenheit ice coolant recently we have changed the chain sprocket kit 
with this bike now she is in perfect condition so she is having no main stand so we have to use racing stands for this so we can work comfortably so enjoy thank you